Welcome back, Rail fans, to another mission in Train Simulator Pro USA of the Washington and Western Railroad. Let's get started. Right, doo -doo. Doo. Doo -doo. So I hope all of you guys are having a wonderful day so far. And if you're not, well, let's rail f fan on the Washington and Western Railroad. To forget about your stressful day. To forget about all the crap in the world. So that way, we can come together as a people and relax. So today's contest is going to be a long, heavy one. If you then see what I have, once I couple up to these freight cars, I'll show you. That was a lot of kaboom. So we got our four Washington and Western GP7s. And then we have a variety of uh, center beam, box cars, and these flat cars. I like even it, it even says on these flat cars, Western Railway. Now all it needs is, is a Washington and an and sign. Transporting boards at the rear of the train. Find the uh, car brake or the independent, and time to apply the brake brake. Alright, go in reverse and couple up to these freight cars, the empties, and uh, let's get this train to Tacoma Yard, Tacoma Yard. That was a loud crash. Well, that's my favorite part about the train, is the loud flacking thunder, which I really wish they had when you like start up a long heavy train like this. Let me turn on my cab lights. And hopefully we reach Tacoma Yard before nightfall. Now we are starting a little bit slow because we are on a grade. I'm not sure if the sun's going down or if it's just rising. And I think at this mission, the max speed is probably going to be 40 for the entire mission. Until we get to uh, the train yard.
Look how long the train is coming around the bend. That is awesome. Now, one question you're probably wondering is, why do I add so many freight cars when only I need a certain amount? Well, I like to have a long variety train because it makes it feel more realistic for me. I mean, sure, it affects my speed, but still, I like it. Like that. Got to slow down for 25. And plus, when you hit the brake, it slows down a lot quicker. Because you got four engines, and then you got this massive contest. I'll just keep my my switch set on that track so I don't have to worry about the future switches. in the railroad crossing. on AI freight train, even Olympia Woodyard, taking grain carts out of there, probably just for storage. AI was probably bound for Vancouver. Vancouver train yard or Vancouver food factory. Let me know your up what you pick down in the comments below. Speaking of comments, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe as it is the best way to support out my channel. It's free and you can always change your mind later. With speaking of subscribers, we are on the road to 200 subscribers, so if you do, so make sure to smash that subscribe button, and it really means a lot to me that you guys are enjoying my content. <sighs> Got a long, heavy train.
Even its last card, it's still on the main line. Okay, now it isn't. So you got four box cars and four empty coal hoppers. And now this massive cost us to fill up the yard. Disconnect the wagons. Do hmm, a thousand XP, you say? That's worth a level up. I did not lock unlock anything in that level up. But what I did unlock, get my free free five hundred coins, is another tank car. Let's see where are some more of these tasks. 500, no, but all these are class 2. So, let's see. Tacoma Hut Oil to Kenwick. Yeah, sure, we can do that. We just used our w one Washington and Western locomotive. So I take it the sun's still rising, so hopefully we can reach uh, Kenwick by nightfall or before or at sunset. Now let's get the four tanker cars of diesel fuel out of out of here and get them to Kenwick Yard for the truck. Or truck. My other three units of the Washington and Western. Two are working in Tacoma Hill Yard and the other is working in Vancouver. Because if you don't know, here I'll show you the map. This is Vancouver. You got the train yard, you got the chemical factory, and you got the food factory all right there. So there's three train yards that has to work. And the Vancouver Yard. And two of them, they're just building a train. My other two, they're just building a train to send to Aberdeen for the AI. For the other Washington and Western Rail members. And yes, I like to do a little bit of role playing while I'm in this game. I forgot to turn on my cap light. Now wait, hold up. Why would I want to go take the long way when I could just take the pretty route? So, we're going to take the, the scenic route.
contestant coming up across my favorite bridge in the whole game. I saw another one like that in one of my earlier missions. And hopefully one day we get to cross it. And there's a Washington and Western passenger train bound for Tacoma, Tacoma Station. Is that how you pronounce it? Tacoma, yeah. Tacoma, huh? Tacoma, we'll just call it Tacoma. It says I'm going the wrong way. No, I'm not, game. I know what I'm doing, game. Now I see why I would want to need to go the wrong way. But there's a switch up here that I can screw around with. Great brain. So, we're going to make my train come to a stop. Probably not far enough to switch. Yeah, it's still on that switch track. What we're doing right now is actually considered illegal. I mean, well, I'm not sure if it's actually considered illegal or not. I might be lying. I don't know. But it's technically super dangerous to do this in real life. In the train yard, and not so much as in the train yard. Like if there was, if like if this camera thing wasn't an option, I'd probably get like fined and banned and fa instant failed the mission because of this. <sighs> Sorry, folks, that was my leg again. That popped. So we might actually have to arrive there by nightfall, because it's what, are you like high noon? Okay, stop, stop, stop. And we'll go this way. Alright so I'm going to set my phone down real quick. I gotta go turn on my fan.
All right, now that my fan is on. I just like like it cold in my room. Although I should probably start, start turning my fan on before recording. <laughs> This is probably the shortest train I've ever driven in a while since uh, season one came out. Well, it looks like we got an AI box car train bound for the Woodyard, Washington and Western and Stable Schools down for on the Woodyard. So when it's Burlington Tank Team. Found for Seattle. Look how dangerous that is. Holy crap. We got another AI train that has refrigerator cars. That one's probably bound for Vancouver. Oh, one of our heritage units, the Utah and Arizona Railroad, is currently leaving the Olympia train yard with the tanker cars or Tacoma yard, tanker yard. Oh well, we can go back up to 55. Looks like we got five grain hoppers, five, and eight box cars. And I just received word that my two engines that were working to come out yard are have a train and they're heading for a Beijing power plant.
into a power plant and got a plant, one of our Washington and Western units with empty coal hoppers. Paralleling the road and the river we go. Oh, Washington and West, Western passenger train. We got another Washington and Western passenger train. I cannot speak English. What is wrong with me? Wow. He's going a little bit slow, probably to give the passengers a good look at the river and the road. This is like the only part of our the Washington and Westland main line where the road really follows where, where our tracks really follow the river. And here's another unit led by an ex Amtrak charger unit. And it looks like it might rain. Hoping it doesn't. down for 15. Nope. And we're almost there to Kenwick Train Yard. We're passing Yakama Train Yard. I don't know how to pronounce that.
got a caution coming up. Even this train yard's pretty full. Cool. Three tanker cars, five artillery cars, four empty coal hoppers. And plus my four tanker cars, but they're not coming here. They're going to Kenwick Yard. It looks like the crossing already activated with the gates down. Another Washington and Western with tanker cars probably taken out from Tacoma, or not Tacoma, Kenwick, and bound for like Vancouver. Vancouver oil plant. I think our heritage unit was already taken one to Tacoma oil place. Not that far away from Kenwick Train Yard now. We only got one penalty against us for speeding. Looks like we got another Washington and Western passenger unit probably leaving Kenwick. Going a little bit slow, I don't know why. Maybe that uh, freight train ahead of it doing switching an Olympia train yard. Oh boy, approaching a grade. We should tackle this easy peasy. Didn't lose that much speed on the grade. And now we're going to go downhill, which means we're going to pick up a lot of speed. Slow down for about 35.
Alright, we're pulling to Kenwick. Yeah! Kenwick Train Yard. I cannot speak properly. Sorry, Ken, like turning out. I don't have much in the way of cargo for you. That was actually a uh, mission. Level 10. So we unlocked the super liner. And we unlocked a new locomotive that costs 300000 Well, folks. I got a lot of grinding to do. <laughs> but... I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, hopefully next mission we will be able to see what the RC44 looks like and can do. Anyways, until next time folks, goodbye.